All right, all right. What's going on, everybody? What's up, everyone? We are doing a product review of Topps Chrome Basketball. Topps Chrome Basketball product review. Let's go. What up, Adrian? How's it going? Tops Chrome Basketball OTE. Um, so I know a couple of the guys that we would be looking for in this. So basically, you know, Tops as a company was purchased by Fanatics. And in doing so, Fanatics also has uh, purchased the rights to NBA and NFL. It's going to be a few years still until we see um, Tops products coming out with, you know, NBA and NFL, like three or four years. But Tops decided to make a basically, I would consider it to be similar to Bowman as in a prospect. So all these guys are prospects. These are high school kids. Um, these are high school kids, guys that that aren't in the league yet, but they did a Topps Chrome basketball. Topps Chrome, one of my all-time favorite products. I, I always chase after Topps Chrome refractors of Brady, um, you know, LeBron, Kobe, Topps Chrome refractors, any, pretty much any guy when they used to make the Topps Chrome basketball products and football products, Topps Chrome's kind of one of the key signature rookie cards that you could hit. So this is a product review of Topps Chrome. We're going to open this box up and just see kind of what it's all about. And uh, hopefully we hit some really cool parallels. If you guys are watching live, um, thank you for hopping in and watching. Feel free to comment. You know, this is Davis here. So a lot of you guys know me. I haven't, I don't break as often as I used to. I used to break all the time, but I am going to do a product review today. So. We'll see what we can find in here, guys. I got some good plastic on it. There we go. That or I have a dull knife. Adrian, how's it going, man? Long time no see. Hopefully you're doing well. box here all right let's see what this is all about getting adjusted to Georgia nice different weather down there well I'm not I can't remember where you were from before all right so we have Nathan Amicia Dio rookie these are all I think they're all be rookies so Chris or Emmanuel Maldonado this is a guy that I think is pretty popular in this set and we have a Dio look at this it's like an old school throwback to the old old style tops that's a refractor and there's another Maldonado rookie so a couple Maldonados right away. All right. Davion Mace. Bryce Griggs. And we have another Dio. Look at this. This is a cool looking insert. I like how they have the neon, the neon kind of around him in the same shape that he's in. So far, I'm digging the design. Very similar to, very similar to the uh, tops design they did this year. Jalen Lewis, rookie. We 
Jalen Lewis. Jean Montero. And here's going to be our first probably numbered card, or at least it'll have a shorter print run. Alexandre Saar, which is a forward. And it is going to be numbered to 199. This would be like the Aqua Shimmer. 175 out of 199 on that. Beautiful card. So first numbered parallel we've seen. And we have a Luis Duarte, shooting guard. All right, let's go. We have Tyler Smith. John Ed Walker. And we have a Bryson Warren Levitate insert. Malik Bowman. All right. Nathan Dio. A Levitate Malik Bowman. And there is our first autograph. Luis Duarte, shooting guard. This is going to be a silver refractor. Awesome. Like I said, I don't know a lot about the players. I did do a little bit of research um, and just kind of looked up some single prices and stuff. So, But beautiful on-card autograph love the design and another Maldonado all right hopefully our next autograph is a uh, low numbered parallel let's find a red we have Jai Smith Jalen Lewis and a Jalen Lewis this is the throwback beautiful looking that's also a refractor. And we have an Izan Almanza. Jeanette Walker. Devante's Cobbs. Bully. Future Problems. So that's a different insert. We haven't seen this insert yet. Cool looking. Amen Thompson. I feel like um, this guy was one of the names I was kind of looking at. So the card stock feels good so far. Um, I've noticed the centering seems to be pretty decent on these. We have Dominic Barlow. Asar Thompson. This is another guy that's popular on this. Luis Duerte. This is going to be a refractor. So this is basically the same card that we hit on the auto, just a refractor version, non-autoed. The autos and the numbered cards have a little bit thicker card stock to it um, compared to the like base. Bryce Griggs. All right, we have a blue coming up, which I believe will be to 150. Jalen Martin, Ryan Bully, and we have a Bryce Griggs blue shimmer refractor. That is going to be to 99, actually. 37 out of 99 on that one. Like I said, it's just got a little bit thicker card stock on the refractors. The numbered refractors, anyways. Really nice looking card. And we have a Bryson Warren. So we're about halfway through the box. Should still be seeing another auto. Hopefully some more numbered parallels. We have a black. I believe the black are numbered to 10. So this could be a really great card. We have Tyler Smith. A Maldonado Refractor. 
And we have an Asar Thompson. Let's go. Boom. Eight of ten. That might be a banger, guys. That could be a phenomenal card. Let's have Tarek look this one up. Eight out of ten. Awesome. Awesome hit. That's going to take the stand. Asar, A-U-S-A-R, Thompson, shooting guard. A-U-S-A-R. Malik Bowman. And we have the uh, Maldonado Refractor as well. So that's a nice that's a nice hit. Number to 10, guys. Let's go. Oh, here's a little horizontal. Jazion Gortman. And we have a Matt Bully. Jean Montero. Oh, for real? Tudor Samasescu. Yeah, that's right, Adrian. <laughs> Great last name, man. Uh, we have a Jalen Martin, Dominic Barlow, Jay Jackson, future problems insert, Asar Thompson. We have Bryce Griggs, Coke Yacht. He is popular too, I know that. Malik Bowman, refractor rookie, uh, John Montero, they're all rookies, but. I like the refractors. I have a soft place in my heart for uh, Topps Chrome refractors, guys. All right. Looks like we're going to have a purple, which typically have been numbered to 250. It might be different in the basketball version. He's on Almanza. Jazer Jackson. Rollback, and we have the purple Matt Bully. Look at this purple refractor, beautiful. It is numbered to 299. 299 on this purple refractor. Just a nice looking card. Let's grab some top loaders here, uh, and a Lewis Duarte. All right, a few packs left. Should still be chasing another autographed card. Let's see a big name. Let's see a low numbered. Let's go. Jai Smith. We have TJ Clark. And a Tudor uh, refractor. We'll sleeve that one up. Aman Thompson. Three packs to go. All right, we have TJ Clark, and we have a Nathan Dio. That is not numbered, but it is an Aqua, which typically what they do with these is they'll have a numbered version of the Aqua, and then they'll have a different version of the Aqua that isn't numbered, but it has a print run that's similar to the numbered version, so that's going to be probably out of 99. Very cool. And we have a Jazair Jackson Purple Refractor, which is going to be numbered to 299. And a Matt Booley. Two packs to go. I'm so excited to see some more basketball tops chrome, football tops chrome products coming out. We have Bryson Warren. Amen Thompson Future Problems. And there's the other auto, Tyler Smith. Tyler Smith, numbered to 99, 82 of 99 on that guy. Jalen Martin. So we did end up getting a numbered refractor auto and a silver refractor auto in the box. And so far we did hit one card that was numbered to 10 and a few other numbered refractors. So, so a lot of good numbered parallels in these Topps Chrome. Guys, we have more of these available, so if you decide you want to do a personal box of one of these, 
you know, when we're on our live streams, feel free to reach out to the breaker or one of us directly in a message and we can get you taken care of on a personal. Last pack. Let's hit another numbered parallel here. All right, we have Alexandre Sar, TJ Clark, and we have a silver of Usar Thompson. That's who we hit the uh, refractor number to 10 out of, and a Bryson Warren. So overall, I feel like there was really good value in the box for the box price. Um, I believe Tark looked up the out of 10, and that card alone sells for 300. So overall, I believe there is extremely good value there. We had a ton of numbered parallels. This is probably the best card of the box. The USR, Thompson. Numbered 8 out of 10, guys. 8 of 10. So pretty cool. I, I love the feel of the cards. I like seeing the uh, different kind of parallels they put in there, the future problems and the levitate. Very cool looking parallels. Um, all the numbered refractors, they have really, really nice color to them. The cardstock on the refractors and the autos, they went with a little bit heavier cardstock, uh, which is nice. The base and the silver refractor parallels, they are you know a little bit thinner on the cardstock. Um, overall, I noticed that the centering seemed to be fairly decent on all of these. Um, you know, and I didn't see any like real bad surface blemishes when I was doing it. So I feel like they did a really good job. And it might just be that one box, but uh, I feel like it was a pretty good box and, and a pretty good product. So if you guys are interested in any of this stuff, um, we're gonna probably do a few more product reviews. You know, when new stuff comes out, and yeah. I appreciate it, guys. I'm going to close out the live video. Um, thanks again, and we'll see you next time.